Today we are trying all the Lunchables. I'm excited for this one. I ate these quite a bit when I was a kid. I don't know, let's see what's the, what's the best one. I have my mom here. Okay. Welcome. Hi. I was gonna well, say, okay, so these sandwiches, they didn't have these when I was young, but they did when you guys were young and I used to buy them for you. So I'm actually curious, I don't think I've ever had one of these. Favorite has always been the pizza for me. Now you buy these usually. What's your main one to go for? Like what's the number one? That you buy. I actually don't buy these anymore, really. Like, I'll home make their lunches over buying them. Not for any particular reason, but I I don't know. These are more expensive than making them yourself, obviously. So sometimes it is just better to make them yourself if you want to. So with both of these, you get a drink of Kool-Aid, some Cheez-Its, some gummies. Okay, this is fun. I've always liked these. These are very good. Throw the Kool-Aid in them. Time to mix. <laughs> All right, what are we doing first? We have tons behind us. We also have these gummy ones we're gonna be trying for Valentine's those Day. Those are new, I've never seen those come out. I know, I've never seen those either. But I will say the go-to one, like if I am going to buy any, I would say definitely my go-to is just the- Crackers? The cracker one. I think it's on the bottom right here. Oh, I was like, did you even get the crackers? So the cracker ones, but normally I get the ham and cheddar or the pizza ones the kids like. So those are kind of, I don't know about cold chicken nuggets. It's so good. It is? I've, ha I've had that one so many. <laughs> you have to show them what just happened. Definitely didn't just spill a bunch of water right here. Uh, we'll clean that up later, it's fine. We'll be all right. <laughs> uh, okay, you make the pizza, oh, we're making coolie first, okay. Kool-Aid's the best part. I grew up on Kool-Aid. I don't know though, this is half full now. I feel like you have to take a little sip from it so that way it doesn't know, overfill. <laughs> you took more than a sip. A little overpowered, but it's good. Yeah, I love this stuff, this stuff's so good. So, the, as far as fun starting? opening, let's do the sub sandwich. Sub sandwich? So, this is actually probably my least favorite one. It is your to least tell favorite? To be honest with you. This is probably my least favorite one. This bread, their bread's not good. So it's hard first off, like it is It is hard to the touch. Okay, what would you put in your sub sandwich? Well, you gotta put all the ingredients. Yes. So, yeah, the bread is kind of hard though. That was, that was always my problem, it's it always hard. It. Where's a plate? We need a plate to build on. Wait, this running is like you're sitting at the lunch plate. table. No, my leg is gonna smell like ham all day. I don't know if they can see in the camera. Yeah, we're literally building on my pant leg. Ah, don't touch my leg with it. The dogs are gonna come and lick me. No, okay, go. only put that on half the sandwich, please. Max, you have to have the full experience. Oh you gosh. can't taste test and not use everything That stuff in is it. disgusting, by the way. I, Just a little bit. They always have the mystery meat. I always called it the mystery meat inside of the one. This bowls. does look like ham, more but than this, the square yeah. one. So when we do the cracker one in a minute, I'll show you that one, but there we go. What else did it come with? Let me go grab a plate. Okay, Actually, then. wait, who needs a plate? Oh, we need a plate. Thanks. Your plate, here you go. Okay, so there's our sandwich. <laughs> Put together. Split in half. So I gotta say, if you're over the age of like, I don't know, 10? 15. <laughs> I say these, 10. The 10 price. even, these start to not be enough. I mean, I guess since it's the first one we tried, it goes on top, but it's just, I rate it like a five, like you five see out what of ten. I'm talking about the bread. Like it's not. The bread good, is but very it's not bad. Bad. I feel like it's just like middle. The ham of the is road. not bad though. If I was hungry, I would eat it. After a long math class, though, this is good. Oh wait, but in it, you did get a little cheese it. You got a fruit roll up. And a cool. And egg. your drink. So I would bump it up to a seven. Okay, I'd give it. I'd give it probably a six. Or no, a six. I agree with you. I agree. I'm gonna try one of the cheese it And it's a roll up sour. Okay, this is kind of really hard. And it's cause it's cold. You know when you put fruit rolls in the fridge or freezer, it's like. I'm trying every little bit of it. You gotta have the full experience. It's a sour one. It'll taste different than a regular one. I've had that one, so I just, I like it. It's, it's good. It's interesting. 
Wait, you opened the pizza one and then you left it. Oh yeah, I forgot about that one. <laughs> All right, we'll do that one, I guess. All right, so this is deep dish pizza. So I think I'm less of a fan of the deep dish pizza because you only get one. Usually you get three. So I think it's a little bit more food than this, oh. but they'll taste roughly the same. Do you use the whole sauce packet? Yes. That's so much sauce. No, it's not. It's not as much as you think it is. Just keep going. Max, I'm no, Just keep going. We're not going to be able to split this in half without it making the biggest mess. No. <laughs> it comes with a lot of sauce, guys. We could keep going, but look at it. I'm I'm a fan of the sauce they have, so okay. I usually... Uh, okay, that's enough. That's enough okay. right there. It's a deep dish pizza at the end of the day. This one is the messiest of them all also. Sprinkling the cheese? Oh, just in general? In general, yeah. I agree. So do your friends like watch you make this at school? <laughs> <laughs> I never had Lunchables at school. It, I mean... My mom didn't buy these Honestly, I yet. didn't have Lunchables that often, but every once in a blue moon. Wait, pepperonis? No, we're not fun. You have to do the full experience. You know pepperonis are the worst part of this? I always leave out the pepperonis. Why? Because they're garbage. You their pepperonis, pepperonis are, are just, their, their pepperonis are trash. They give you a lot of pepperonis. Yeah, you don't need that many. How am I supposed to split this in half? I'm just gonna take a bite. Okay. It's actually pretty good flavored. So there's a pepperoni on the floor and Harley just licked it, tried to eat it and then just turned around and spit it out. See, it's too much sauce. Hold it over or something. This thing's so good. Oh, open this. This has bacon in it. I'm excited for that. Can you open this? Like open it? Oh, you're gonna stick it one in. One more bite. Okay, you can tell Max really likes this one. He ate the whole thing. That's some S tier food right there. Mm -hmm. I gotta tell you. Drink my Kool-Aid. Max is in there grabbing a plate right now, but guys, he's so cute. I love all these like trying videos and like doing these videos together and just spending time and trying different foods and rating them and it's just so fun. Love it. Oh, that one came with trolleys. Okay, what would you rate the pizza? We got a plate. Deep dishes on top for me. Now. Wait, what would you rate it on a one to 10? I'd give it an eight. I agree. It's eight. good. It was pretty good actually. All right, cold chicken nuggets. Sounds absolutely horrible, but trust me. Just trust me. It's good. I'm so scared for this one. So this comes with a Capri Sun and your chicken nugget meal with some nerds in it. I like nerds. So pretty small meal, but they should make ones for adults. They should make adult. So literally nerd clusters are my absolute favorite. So I'm happy that it came with nerds, but. Okay. Take your cold chicken nugget. Always have to put it in the ketchup. That's just how it works in you. It feels wrong. Like it feels like I'm gonna get sick from it. Are you sure? It's good. Oh gosh. Goes above. Um, I'm nervous. Goes above the sandwich one for me, but it goes below pizza. Not a bad flavor, actually. Yeah. <laughs> a little weird that it's cold. Would you say a seven? Mm-hmm. Seven. What do you want to do next? Mm. Choose your poison. Let's do the. Let's say choose your poison. Let's go with the classic, the turkey and cheddar, or it's usually ham and cheddar. Put that up against the competitor, which is below the. Um... Wait, you do have another pizza one. Should we do the pizza first? No, 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 pizza one. We'll do that one last. Okay, it's competitor. Oh, this is off brand. Uh huh. Okay, so we're gonna do the Lunchable brand versus the, what brand is this? Amore brand. This one comes with a Butterfinger, which I love Butterfingers too. But this one comes with Reese's, which is good. The only difference is there's a Capri Sun for this Lunchable one. Save those Capri Suns, the yeah. kids will be excited about that. Capri Sun pile. We're gonna have a pile of them by the end of this. Okay. What? So I gotta say, this brand usually comes with a better side, so that like this one has a Butterfing. Uh, I guess Reese's is pretty good. Which one comes with more? So, hold that. Count crackers. Count crackers. <laughs> Five crackers? 
It comes with five. See, I don't feel like this is like a sustainable good lunch. It comes with six. Okay. So they the upped lunch it by one. one. <laughs> it's like, I'll one up you. <laughs> but here is the mystery meat. This meat. Yeah, it's kind of. Is scary. It's, you don't know where it came from. Oh, it's, it feels so gross, too. It feels slimy. It is. Like, it literally feels... Ooh. It's just... This is just wrong. I This is never my go-to. The mystery meat's not great. Like, I'm genuinely not excited to eat this. But I gotta say, that meat looks the exact same. It's like a two for me. This cracker is much, much better than that one. You think so? Mm -hmm. Just take the candy and run on this one. <laughs> oh, I'd, give it, I'd give it like a five. You would? It's not bad, but I would much rather do the Lunchable one over the off-brand. It, it just has a little bit better of a flavor. Not by much, though. I was like, they tasted the same thing. All right, we did the bonus. <laughs> I'm excited about this the one. The breakfast actually. combos. I didn't know they made these. But I guess if you're like rushing in the morning. Yeah. Oh. I don't oh, know. I don't know. The pancake looks soggy. They do. Okay. This is one I'm not excited for actually. You said you're excited. <laughs> I was originally until you see the pancakes. It literally it looks, looks like a soggy pancake. Max, I don't know syrup. if we can do this one. You do like I'm a... I'm grabbing the least soggy one. No, no, that's, that's the most. It was on the bottom. Oh, that's you don't do that I'm not doing this one. You have to do it. That is gross. Like that is genuinely gross. Just try it. This is also not Lunchable brand, by the way. It's not it. Wait, that's try gross. A piece of what? If you had to. No. No, just don't eat. That's it. The pancakes taste kind of like powdery. I don't know if I could force but myself to eat this. How's the bacon? The bacon's better than the pancake. Yeah, that's a no for me. <laughs> Harley? No that's a bacon. two. For me, that's a two. That goes below everything. Yeah. That, that one's bad. That one's really bad. That one's one of the worst. So we are on our last actual Lunchable here. Capri Sun Pile. Ending with pizza. So this comes with an airhead. Oh my goodness, this is my favorite. So the only difference, I can't open. My hands are all greasy. Mine, from the, mine are too. The bacon. God. So I gotta say, if you pack this in your lunch, put a butter knife in your lunch with you. Because that was, that was always a little Yeah, it make it easier. Because then you have to spread it all weird with the sauce packet and then when you go to squeeze it back out, you get it all over your hands and it's all gross. Oh, I picked the right one. I didn't even realize which one I picked. This one doesn't come with pepperonis, which is the way I like oh, it. Oh, it's just cheese. Two cheese. Oh, two cheese. Yes. You got double the cheese, guys. Um, What's that? I'll Airhead. Your Airhead. So I just like to mix these up a little bit. Now, I think the correct way to do this is to spread. So you got to kind of do it a little bit. There's a whole your method to it. Your first two, you do less. Like you just, you don't, the first two aren't fun, but you look towards the future. <laughs> like you only do that much. And then I, I like to spread with the back. Why with the back? Now you can't put your hands back there. You point. don't put your hands back there, but you just do a little bit. And then you do a little bit on your second one and then you load your third one. Yeah, you so do you like that. Save the best for last. Yeah. They don't give you a lot of cheese. Again, this is one of the messier meals you can, <laughs> they have. But it's not bad. It's, it's good. I enjoy it. I actually like the deep dish. Or maybe because it's not as much sauce. <laughs> it was good. It was good. S tier pop for me. I would rate it the same as the deep dish. Like if you put the same sauce, I feel like an eight. I'm actually really surprised. That's really good. I oh, haven't had a lot good. of Lunchables to be honest. Like I buy them, but I haven't really like sat and ate them myself. And my mom never, you know, bought these growing up. So this is my first time really testing and like trying them out. And they're really, 
good. Well, some of them. Surprisingly, I didn't think the pizza would be good or the chicken nuggets. Cause, yeah. It's just, it's just good. I, I could eat this for lunch, man. This is so good. Our last ones are the gummies. I'm actually excited about these. And there's a pizza one and like the cheese and cracker one. So let's do the cheese and cracker one first. We don't know what's going on above us. Construction. Construction. Oh yeah, dad's up there. These even look like more of a mystery meat than the actual mystery meat. <laughs> Why would they make it so pink? All right, I'm back in this. I can't get it open. After that enjoyable. I'll try to open this one. Uh, they do not make this easy to open. What is that liquid? Wait, I don't think you can see it. That's your pizza sauce. <laughs> No, no they didn't. That's your pizza sauce. No they didn't, no they didn't. I'm just gonna pretend that I didn't see that. It looks really liquidy Dude, and messy. Is, why is this so hard to open? I know, I couldn't get it open either. No, it ripped. Why? Oh, smell that. It's got an interesting smell to it. It smells like... That's something gummy. Oh my gosh. So you take your cracker. Yeah. This one comes with six crackers, so same as Lunchable. Does it? <laughs> that is some mystery meat. The cheese. The... I think this is supposed to be cheese. These okay. things are very hard to open. I got, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Okay, so this one's pink. He's gonna try the red one. <laughs> Why? Why? How do you like it? I mean, it's good. It's not good. It's it's a gummy. No. It, it's a gummy. No. Just no. Stick to only making much more. You ready to make some pizza? I don't know if I can do it. <laughs> it's not that bad. Dude, this thing is so hard to open. You're gonna spend half your lunch trying to open this thing. Here's your pizza sauce. No, we are Oh, you punctured it. <laughs> yeah. That's Spread it. Mess That's all heavy. Over. It's a heavy gummy? Yes. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> okay. Wait, I'm going to spread on this. There's a hole somewhere. Oh, that's bad. That's just. That's going to make a mess. <laughs> Okay. Ew, it's too liquidy. Spread, spread some on. <laughs> it's not like pizza sauce. I'll hook you up with some cheese. Stop. <laughs> There's some pepperonis, if you will. <laughs> I can't, guys. What does the liquid taste like? Oh, actually, the liquid's pretty good. Taco? It's like sour. I can't, I can't bite that. So the sauce is actually pretty good. And the pepperoni and cheese, but I, I can't bite that. I don't know. I like that one better. So the pizza one is even better in the gummy than it is in the ham and cheese one. Do you agree? I agree. Well, this was uh, the worst one of these episodes we've ever done. This was just the best one. What's the best one? The pizza. What's the worst one? Breakfast. The breakfast one. Sorry, there's construction and going on cheese. upstairs. But um, hammer cheese wasn't very good. Breakfast wasn't very good. Pizza was the best. The nuggets and were pretty good. Just take the candy out of it and run. So thank you all for watching today's video. 
I hope you all enjoyed, and I will catch you guys next time. Guys, <laughs> the construction is, that's funny. Here's a picture of Maddie, by the way.